Hi, thanks for stopping by. Today on It's Vegan, we are going to reinvent our Thanksgiving Day leftovers. Let's head to the kitchen and get started. Emily's going to make her own leftover bowl and I'm gonna make mine. So I am starting with a little bit of gravy first. I don't know if Emily is. Yep. And then next, I'm putting in the mashed potatoes. And typically, they're gonna get pretty stiff overnight in your fridge. So what I did was I added a little bit more plant milk for these. And I wanna make a hole because that's where I'm going to put my corn and more gravy. Emily, what are you doing? I'm really going to mix it all together like a bowl. Not how I would usually eat stuff. I usually don't want my things touching, but for this, I mix it all up. Putting on the corn. This is a great way to use those leftovers from Thanksgiving and make them look a little bit different than the day before. It is one of my favorite ways to eat our leftovers from Thanksgiving. You need some. No, I just thought I'd just let you catch up. But while Emily's doing that, I'm going to put a chunk of stuffing on the side so that it ends up heating when everything else is. And over here, I'm leaving room for my cranberry sauce when it comes out of the oven. Would you like some more gravy? I will take the gravy now. Are you done with the corn? I am done with the corn. I'm just gonna use this. And I have some vegan, not chicken shreds I'm using here. And I just put a tiny, tiny bit of vegan cheese on it. And then it's surprising, but these are vegan. Put those on top. And I'm going to bake mine in a 350 oven until it's hot and bubbly. That'll probably be 20, 30 minutes. I wanted to use a sharp cheddar-ish type of vegan cheese. I have a slice I'm just going to break out here. And I'm just going to throw mine in the microwave. If you decide to put the french fried onions on yours, the microwave's not the best choice. We'll be back when they're hot. Soon. Well, I added some cranberry sauce and pea salad after it was finished baking. You ready to dig in? Yep. This is a great way to eat leftovers. It is, and it's totally different for me because the first time I go through, I eat everything separate. And then when I make my bowl afterwards, I mix it all together. Hey, join us next week. Please subscribe, like, and share. Bye.